anticipate this game to be this long. Well, that's not good. Now I'm trapped. Ah, uh, yeah, no. Thank you, Anonymous, for the short scream and the biddies. Oh my fucking god! Okay, let's make sure these windows are fucking. Weird. Tap, tap. Who the fuck just used that tree? You fucking prick! Oh my god! <sighs> Fucking son of a bitch. The back slider's open. Oh, Tama. Thank you. Fuck, fuck. I somehow managed to stagger him. Alright, so if you find a pig, you can toss it on the hook. But don't do anything yet. Just put it on the hook. Then we need a second one after that. Oh, really? I'm gonna die to a fucking pig, man. <laughs> You and I are like nachos with jalapenos. Yeah. I'm super cheesy, you're super hot, and we belong together. A plus pickup line. I'd go on your date. Oh, triangles. We saw the... Uh oh. <gasps> oh, fuck. To go check real quick. Aha! I didn't hear the light bulb go out, but. Oh, God! Where did you come from? Other side. Okay. Got it. So you just went around. Clever. That's locked. I don't like this at all. Okay, it's just somebody walking on by across the hallway looking for the bathroom. I don't need the bathroom anymore because... Fucking unbelievable. Ugh. All right. Once inside the suite, no options can be accessed. Good luck. Oh, that's mean. I can still taste those fucking noodles. Oh, right. I forgot. <laughs> I fucking hit pause. Oh, no. Jesus. The voice reminds me of the lady from SpongeBob. Chocolate. I remember when they invented chocolate. I've always hated it. <laughs> it's very similar. <laughs> oh, shit. Chocolate. I remember when they first invented chocolate. Sweet, sweet chocolate. I always hated it. <laughs> Thank you, Bud Cheek. Weird, I had this pulled up, I thought the same thing. <laughs> I feel like this is like fucking Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty and I have to run back and forth naked for 20 minutes and literally do nothing. All right, there's gonna be something else here. Oh, why? 
Oh, fucking bitch. Oh, rat bastard. Oh no, uh. They all. Oh, I seen that picture before I feel like I saw that picture <gasps> what the fuck you know what I'm saying <laughs> just let them down two are upstairs come on baby Ooh. cups there's the shovel Oh, you fucker. <sighs> All right, I don't have anything for that yet. I can close that. I, I can, I can close, I can, thank you. Those are closed. What the fuck is that all about? Come on. <sighs> of a nurse who has been causing harm to patients. According to reports, the nurse has been forming a series of brutal tests on her patients and taking parts of their bodies, leading to the deaths of several patients. There have also been reports of strange and paranormal occurrences happening in the hospital, further adding to the stress of patients and staff. The nurse is still missing. Oh, Fuck. I won't they see that coming. Oh, come on. Oh, this is interesting. Danger. Oh, <gasps> fucking. Oh. <laughs> oh, hey. What's up? Welcome in, everybody. Hope you're all doing swell. I've had a pretty decent Wednesday. Um, you know, work was work. Uh, in terms of things I wanted to get done outside of work stuff, uh, I did almost nothing. Um, but I did do some organization with a spreadsheet that I really needed to do. So there was that. Um, but yeah, watch some wrestling with Knox and Heavy for a bit, and here we are. It's our second and unfortunately final stream of the week. Um, but... It's all for good reasons why I won't be here. Uh, tomorrow night, I am seeing, um, let's see, at the, I think it's at the Middle East. I should really look this up, but I'm pretty sure it's the Middle East downstairs. <coughs> it is uh, Wake, uh, Inter Arma, End, and Full of Hell. And then Friday is, I'm pretty sure it's Converge, Cave-In, and Botch, which is going to be crazy. Saturday is going to be the AEW Full Gear pay-per-view. And then Sunday is Despised Icon, Acacia Strain, and Dying Fetus. So I'm very, very busy <laughs> over the next couple of days. Um... I even think about the whole week I've had something going on. Monday night was Tool, and we streamed last night, and here we are tonight. Uh, so yeah, if you missed out yesterday, we played uh, we played some fun games. Um, we played the new Chillizart game called The Kidnap. 
fucking two thumbs up on the story. Like, it really took me a while after that game while I was playing Paranormal VHS for, like, things to click. And I'm like, it was an interesting way to, you know, that's interesting twist they threw into the story that I wasn't, I didn't see coming. And it, like, in the moment, I was just kind of, like, surprised. But I'm like, what? <laughs> okay. And I kind of just went with it. And I was, then I was focused on getting the endings and... And uh, there are a couple of things like pieced together, like as I was getting Paranormal VHS ready, and I'm like, oh, huh. But uh, yeah, Paranormal VHS onto that game. Uh, pretty decent. It's one of those indie horror games that uses a lot of those uh, assets that get recycled a lot. Um, but they did a lot with what they had. Um, for in some areas more than others, I think the lighting in the game was fantastic. Um, whether it was pitch black and all you had was the flashlight that was super shitty, uh, and it gets shittier later in the game, or it was, um, uh, I, I would say probably like how they designed the map out. It felt very maze-like, even though it was supposed to be a hospital. It was, it was interesting. Um, but then like the jump scares are pretty cheap, but they got, they got me a handful of times, not going to lie. They were effective. Um, and then the one time I died in the game, the kid, like the, <laughs> the kill scene was pretty goofy. It was just the head like flailing around on, um, on that, that asset, like grandmother or mother with no hair in the dress. Um, yeah, it was pretty good. I enjoyed it, you know, the, and the game was longer than I thought, too. I figured it'd be like another hour. It was, I feel like it was an hour and 30, hour 45. It went a while. Um, yeah, so that was yesterday. Tonight, we're going to be playing Nightmare of Decay. Um, I know very little about this game. Uh, all I know is that I'm, let's say, I think, I think this game was in the Emeka bundle, even though it's not an Emeka game. Um... But uh, Ken's here. Ken mentioned that it was a good time, so I'm looking forward to playing it. And then whatever time we have afterwards, it's another game that was actually part of the Emeka bundle just recently, uh, Last Lesson. So we'll be dipping to that if we can. It's literally RE1. Well, <laughs> okay then. I'm in. To all of you that are here early, cheers to you all. Only got a couple of these left. I need to, I need to fucking visit Colin from Sour Not Sorry and get some more beers. Cause I literally have this one, one more of these, and then two Octafants and that's it. He has a bunch of, he has all of his, uh, his Thanksgiving specials are out. One of them is like cranberry, peach, white peach and vanilla. And then the other one is like, it, I can't remember exactly what's in it, but it's basically a sweet potato pie beer. And I'm like, yo, I'm in, I'm going to try it. So cheers. Mm. And I fucking drip it all over me. I'm an idiot. If you ever play the original RE, you'll find many similarities. They literally used parts of the game. Oh, wow. Yo, Vandra, what's up? Welcome in. How you doing, friend? As I wet my sweatpants with beer. If you're all not hanging out with Vandra, hit that link and uh, drop a follow. Please do. Uh, one of my... Very, very good friends in the CEOs of Screams. Cheers, get a bib. Yeah, I guess so, huh? Here we go. Yeah. And this is a pumpkin pie sour, by the way. <clears throat> Doing good. Aw, shucks. <laughs> You've been an absolute animal on Twitter, I gotta say. The one thing I got done today that was on my checklist of things to do um, was to take all of your um, tags on Twitter and basically put them into like an Excel with links and name of the game, checkbox if I've turned in an audition and due date. And I'm like, yeah, I've done something productive. And there's like, I think like eight of them I was interested in. The hustle is real. <laughs> yeah, for exactly. Um, so I'm trying to think what else we have for news. We, don't, uh, we already know what the schedule is. Nothing crazy about that. Um, Joe Boodless is Joe. Welcome in, friend. How, I hope you had a good day today. <clears throat> um, oh, then obviously, 
I just been mentioning it. Uh, so Vandra's been helping me out, um, throwing me leads on voice acting cast calls. Excuse me. <laughs> And it's just something I'm kind of like, I'm interested in, in, in checking out. Um, I don't have like a Go XLR mic or anything like that, but um, I figure if I can maybe improve a couple things like the acoustics in the room, maybe that will help. I don't know, but you know, it's, it's not terrible. Bless you. Yes. <laughs> uh, so no, we'll see. We'll see if I get lucky somewhere. I just think it would be cool if my voice is in a game like... Pay means nothing. <laughs> I will do work for free. Um, but, uh, yeah, shit. I think that's really all I have. I don't have anything really exciting else to be sharing, at the moment at least. Um, but I guess I will say that I need to check on the poll. Is that I did make a poll for the things we owed for Jugtober. And right now... It's still pretty much the same as yesterday, except now there's more votes for gray sweatpants. Great. But uh, it's not in the lead. It's currently in a three-way tie with the discounted sound alert stream, Jackbox Party Community Night. Uh, and it's, so it's third, so it's tied in third behind uh, the Ghost Pepper Challenge, Exorcist VR stream are tied for second. And in the lead is none other than having my dad, or some people know him in chat, Die Trump Die, will be on stream with me. Um, it'll more than likely be a Saturday during the day. Um, and yeah, we'll be hanging out. I don't know if I'll continue stream later that night. I think I'll just stream a few hours during the day with him, and then I'll just call it a day. Um, but we'll see what happens. Um, so if you're interested in checking out this particular poll, by the way, you could drop into our Discord and uh, you'll see it in the polls uh, channel. And effectively, all you do is press the uh, react emotes at the bottom of the poll uh, to see which one you want to vote for. <laughs> uh, it seems like everything's got a vote except for the lefty mode clone hero stream. The only, I voted for everything so the buttons would be there and make life easier for everybody. Um, so technically there's none. <laughs> hey, that's okay. I could put that off as long as I can. <laughs> Playing lefty guitar hero is gonna suck. Oh, okay. That's all I have, I swear. So, I'm ready to play some Nightmare of Decay, and I hope you are too. Where's my sound, my bobber? There it is. <clears throat> All right. Let's go hang. Okay. Ba 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 da ba. Ba ba da ba. Oh, yeah, I did the options already, so we're good to go. All right, so. Here's the thing. I know a lot of people are just, I play the hardest difficulty, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, that's cool. Like, hats off to you. Uh, but I suck at video games. I'm just here to play. <laughs> so normal it is. Damn. It is uh, 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 what a fucking beat. News reporter. 23-year-old Judith Glasslow was reported missing yesterday evening. She's described as Caucasian, 5 feet 7 inches tall, with a slim build and long brown hair. Blech. Excuse me. It sounds like he's saying, is this Vietnam? And it's like all chopped up. <laughs> she was last seen entering her apartment for being escorted home by friends following a late night out clubbing. Bless. Thank you, Vandra. <laughs> Police searched her apartment and interviewed neighbors, but have been unable to find any clues leading to her current whereabouts. <laughs> In comes the fucking Law and Order intro from Tree. Have you tried doing some hot sauce or nah? I have not yet. Um, oh, that does remind me. Uh, for one, I pressed the wrong button. And for two, um, uh, I looked at the stream elements issue. It turns out the uh, 
the breach they had was directly with their Discord and Discord invite link. Um, when it came to their tools and everything that I use, it was not impactful. Uh, and I completely forgot that I looked that up like <laughs> like 10 hours ago. <laughs> so uh, I'll do I'll do some spins after we beat this game um, and before you do the second one. Yeah, welcome in, Tree. Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> Did I already read this one? I don't remember. Close friends and relatives say that Glasslow had been complaining about frequent nightmares and hallucinations in the days before she went missing. It is unknown if these had anything to do with her disappearance. Is, is, not, is, not, the, is, is not the, not the, is not the, Glasslow is the latest in an alarming number of recent disappearances that have local residents spooked. Authorities say there have been over 10 missing people reported in just the past week. The, is, the, the, is not, is not, is not the, Police have been unable to find any new leads in their investigation of the disappearances and implore anyone with information to call the Missing Persons Investigation Unit at... That's not good. Oh, you turn off the TV. You've been having terrible nightmares recently and watching news about these disappearances is just going to make them worse. Yikes. It's getting late and you're feeling pretty tired. You should eat dinner and take a shower before going to bed. You're pretty sure that there was a leftover slice of pizza in the fridge. Bro, I would never leave one slice of pizza in the fridge. That's crazy. Look around by moving the mouse. Oh my god. Look at this. Oh yeah, bottom left-hand corner, the fucking health meter. Definitely RE1. <laughs> Get food. A couple beers in there and some bananas. Yeah, you know. Got pizza slice. Hover over an item and I can right-click it to eat it. Oh, or use it. Okay. A cold slice of pizza, I should heat it up before eating it? No. Fuck, it won't let me. I have to heat it up. Damn it. Can't use this to heat up food. Yeah, this is the night, bitch. Dolly. Hello. Thank you for the biddies. Hope you're doing well today. What do you mean I... Who in the right world uses a microwave for anything else other than heating up food? Oh, I had to click. Fuck me. You need heat to heat food? I know. Zero to five stars. Can't eat cold pizza. Yeah, for real. Like it's even going to be warm after fucking two seconds. All you've done is made a hot spot and oh my ate the pizza faster than it had in the microwave. Oh, they want to take a shower before bed. Oh, I picked the right one. Let's take a shower. Brad couldn't get that microwave to work and rage quit? Yeah, I had to click. It's E for ins inspect. And I was hitting E the whole time. All clean this time to go to bed. Oh, fantastic. Like, it should be a left click here to do that. I mean, I don't know if you can re rebuy anything. What? How did the TV turn on by itself? I should turn it off. That's your fucking concern? Probably somebody in that room. He said, stick your food up your ass. <laughs> That's That sounds like Brecky. As soon as you turn off the TV, you suddenly notice the reflection of the TV screen that there's someone sitting behind your sofa. You turn around and see a large man staring at you with a crazy smile on his face. His hoarse breathing echoes throughout the room. The man's holding the decapitated head of a woman. Thoughts of the recent disappearances come to mind and a cold chill runs up your spine. In the next moment, the man fades away just as suddenly as he appeared. Oh, must be more tired than you thought if you're starting to hallucinate. Maybe eating that pizza before going to bed was not the best of ideas. No, it was not. <laughs> Call the priest. Oh, I need more than a priest. A good night's sleep should help to refresh your mind. You hope that you don't have another nightmare tonight. Oh, well, anything like my experience, you having a nightmare. <laughs> Remember his face. I will. Is that? 
All right, so we've got this, nothing there. All right, so let's save the game first. Oh, game saved, cool. That is the game of the game, Inception. If you try to play games right now, then shut the fucking computer off, you dickhead. You gonna leave it on to warm up the room? <sighs> Welcome to Nightmare of Decay. Oh, oh no. Fuck, apparently we're buried alive again. Oh, this is not good. Yo, plot twist, where the zombie? <laughs> I know that I'm at a manor, and I know it's floor one, apparently. Ah! That literally scared the shit out of me. Oh my god. <laughs> and, it, and it wasn't even like that good of a... <gasps> I can't pet... You see a cat sitting on the railing at the top of the stairs. It stares at you with unnaturally intelligent eyes. <laughs> Hello, stranger. Cat greets you, and strange enough, you can understand what it is saying. <laughs> what's all right? So, what's this cat gonna sound like? Should we make it sound like Thackeray Binks from Hocus Pocus? <clears throat> Looks like the nightmares claimed yet another victim. Many have been brought here against their will, only to meet a terrible end one way or another. No one has ever managed to escape alive. The cat pauses to look you up and down, almost as if to appraise you of your worth. It seems unimpressed. I wonder how long you'll be able to survive for. Not long if I had to make a guess. It's the meanest cat ever. It'll be fun to see how you meet your end in this horrible place. Maybe one of the monsters will get you. Or maybe you'll go insane and end yourself. Wow, that's really rude. Well, I need to get going. Good luck, stranger. Try not to die too fast. That's the shittiest cat I've ever seen in any video game. Oh boy. Can I, I wanna pick that up immediately, please. Immediately, I don't care if it's a murder weapon. I need it right now. I can explain things later. The door is being held closed by a rusty old padlock. I could probably break the padlock if I hit it with something. Okay, can I can I hit it with my fucking survival knife? Or sign hotkey. Well, well. Let me go check the rest of the, uh... There's two other doors here. Let's see what this one does. Escape. Gate won't budge. Looks like I'll need to find another way out of this place. Of course. And I'm assuming this door is probably locked as well. Furniture is locked. Maybe I can find the key if I look around. Alright, well. Did you one better? Unless there's something in here. I woke up in that coffin. How did I even get here? Hmm. Well, good question. Alright. So, good thing I went over this way and... Dealt with the fucking asshole cat. Here we are. We're in the basement. Good call. Uh oh. This is unsettling. This man's getting his food. Oh, it's a gun! And a key! Oh, how convenient! The right guy died here! Oh, hey, it's the face. What the hell is that? Dude, how many times are you gonna... Fuck you. 
and let's not be stupid. Remember, you always got to double tap. That's more than double tap, but um, it's a mutilated body of a man. He's been partially eaten. Hell yeah, brother. Oh, hey, what happened to Doug Funny? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> was this Skeeter? <laughs> I got the manor key, and I got a pistol. That's uh, <laughs> okay. Got a pistol, good to go. Door stuck and won't budge. Okay. Can I use this key here? I guess not. I can't right click here. All right, well, I gotta go to the front door. No, he's not green. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> Wait, no, Skeeter was blue. Roger Klutz was green. God, Roger Klutz. And then who is the, uh, who is the football player? No, no, he, maybe he just had green hair. I can't remember. Oh, this room looks real familiar. Ah, ammo, health, and a save spot? I have a sprint. Pistol ammo. Health drink. And save the game. All right. I guess I'll start here. <laughs> so opening room tomorrow is 64. <laughs> I mean, it it didn't look it looks a little like that. I, I'll give you that. Um, more like RE1. Probably unlock it with a block pick. Okay, good to know. Press N to read. Hair stained note one. William has been acting strangely ever since we moved into this manor. He's been spending all this time in the basement doing God knows what. I've tried asking him about it, but he became angry and confrontational. I fear we may be drifting apart. I hate this place. We never should have come here. Oh. Excuse me. All right. Fuck, I forgot to actually, like, assign it. You're a dick. There we go. Oh, dude, I'm doing good. All right, that wasn't bad. I started off real bad and I figured it out. Hold on, is, is there is there an achievement for that? Nope, there are no achievements in the game. Well, that makes that easy. Here's the opening. Oh, yeah, I already fucking read that. God damn it. Oh, you unlock more shit. Oh. The free fucking pistol ammo. You know what? Let's give it one more try. Trying as high score as possible within a lot of time. Score points hitting red targets. Time can be extended by hitting the blue target. Prizes are unlocked for reaching various score amounts. Oh, okay. So 
The time's only extended by hitting the blue target. I didn't know that. I thought I thought it was both. Okay. Well, that's fun. Fuck. Oh, yeah. Does this thing shoot actual bullets? Fuck, I love this. Pinpoint accuracy once you wait a little longer enough. Oh, oh! That was a lucky shot. Fuck. Yep. The fives you have to get so quick and kind of lucky with your shots like that. But I got it that time. We broke a hundred. I think 120 is one of the prizes. Oh fuck. Oh! Last second. 120. We've unlocked something else. I don't remember what the last one is. Maybe 180. be here all night. No, not really. I think this is the last one I'm going to do, regardless of what the score is. Wish I was just going to Tarkov. Fuck. I'm almost at 200. 200. Oh. <laughs> Just going for it now. Oh. Yeah, I had that one shot just to hit it in the game, but that was good. Mm. 224. I needed 150. <laughs> Oh, I was a lock pick. I thought it was a different kind of knife. Is this... Dude, is this serious? Is that gun seriously? Roughly shoot small metallic pellets, mainly used for shooting targets that shoot in gallery. Not, not effective as an actual weapon. Oh, okay. <laughs> How do I drop it? <laughs> oh, right mouse, unequip, okay. And then, I can't really assign anything else, can I? Oh, I can unassign. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. Damn. Okay, so we'll do knife and pistol. One and two. Oh, that was fun. I enjoyed that room immensely. Now I can open this up. My lockpick. Dynamite, health, pistol, shotgun. Oof. I'm rolling in it right now. Let's try this way. The door is locked. The shape of a spade has been carved onto the lock. Um, is that in my map? Oh, it is. It's just like, uh, this is so much like Resident Evil. Like, look, this room is green now. <laughs> Wait, why isn't that room green? That's weird. Well, just open world RE1. Essentially. <clears throat> Anything good in here? No? No food? Dicks. 
Inventory can be used while in examine mode, tab to access your inventory, hover over an item, and right click. Yeah, yeah. Number of coin shaped indents above the fireplace. An old farmer, tired from a day of hard labor, falls asleep under the shape of a tree while his loyal dog watches over him. Alright, cool. So I gotta find those three pieces. And that's gonna be like, I bet you it's a secret door and the fireplace moves over or something. Let me check this room first. Okay. Gonna have to start using this now. <laughs> Jesus. Ha! I had a good feeling. Pistol ammo. Whoa. Oh, there's two of you. How many shots do you need? Okay. God damn. Seven headshots each. If we're stuck in the shaft, maybe I can dislodge it from above. Hmm. Better off with the knife. Oh, Almost. The dumb, way, the damn dumb way is broken again. I was spent. I was sending up the pantry key to the second floor, and the platform got stuck in the shaft on the way up. No, I can get into the pantry until the stupid lift is fixed. Lord William is going to be furious. Maybe dropping something heavy into the shaft from the second floor would be enough to dislodge it. Noted. Oh. I don't miss anything anywhere. Oh, that's the pantry. Yeah, okay. Door to the pantry. The faint stench of rotten meat is coming from behind. Try to open the door, but it won't budge. After one of a rough voice suddenly calls out to you from the other side. <laughs> is someone there? Please, I need help. <laughs> I've accidentally locked myself in here and I can't get back out. <laughs> While well, I've been stuck in here, my precious collection has been rotting away. I must escape so that I can add fresh toys to it. <laughs> Please, we can help each other. You wish to get in, and I wish to get out. <laughs> the key to the door should be somewhere in the manor. <laughs> it's a large blue key with the word pantry carved onto it. Please hurry. I do not wish to spend another moment stuck in here. My collection is rotting away. All right. Well, fuck. Well, double fuck. Triple fuck. Quadruple fuck. Oh, fuck. The whole goddamn kitchen staff's here. Good thing I found all of that fucking ammo on everybody. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Thanks, Bootylicious. <laughs> Appreciate you. They, they, they couldn't drop me some ammo or something? I mean, they're also chefs. They wouldn't have ammo. Let's, let's be honest with ourselves here, Jug. All right, or they can just have a ton of ammo everywhere, too. That also works. Empty jar. I don't know what that's for. Oh, we're about to find out. 
Press N. Access to some areas of the manor has been obstructed by a strange fleshy growth. Lord William has tasked me with finding a solution to this issue. I've discovered that a mixture containing equal amounts of linoleum, otazon, and aquaverum could be used to create a corrosive acid that could dissolve the fleshy growth and regain access to previously obstructed areas. Empty B community could fill it with something. Oh yeah, okay, I see. And then we put the empty jar there. Yep. And then, so we'll have to basically put shit in here and run it. Okay. <clears throat> I'll be on the lookout for that stuff. Oh. Okay. A big circle. So. I can now go through the door where it was knocked in. Bloody sack. That can get dropped from the top. That'll work just fine. Alright, and there's nothing else around here. No. Okay. Then to the second floor we go. Where are we here? Oh, okay, so this comes out over in this side. Right, right, wait, what's around the corner? Oh, I see. I see now. We'll come back here and go up here. All right, word. This is where I came from. Although now there's no body here. I was like, it needs to be knocked loose. Uh huh, uh -huh. arf, arf. <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay, 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 okay. Let's do a quick save a Rooney. To the second floor we go. Also, the store. motherfucker. What the fuck was that? Oh, far, far from motherfucker. Okay, it took a second. Oh. Oh, fuck, no, I ain't fighting dogs right now. No way. Nope. Not, deal <clears throat> not dealing with them until I find a shotgun. Great. Tell me this other door is locked. Mm. Okay. 19 shots against two dogs. This'll go well. Nice, there's a way to sneak past them, but that ain't gonna happen. Uh. Not with this design in this economy. Oh, do they not come up here? Oh, fuck. No, run. I can't run while I'm reloading. Okay, I didn't know that. All right. So that's a problem. I didn't know that you slow down when you're reloading. I need to remember that. Now, do they reset or are they right back here? Oh, they reset. I wonder if their health resets too. Hopefully not. Oh, you fucker. Oh. I could do without the death sound. Oh, awful. Sorry, tree. Oh, they were chomping good, too. We have here pistol ammo. Let's go. I actually go even slow. It's even slower than a walk. Oh, good to know. Ooh, got some more little 
friendly stuff back here. Shotgun ammo and another health drink. That's good. We'll check this corner, then we'll go into the little building. So that was pointless. No point of these boxes. I don't think I can break them. No. Didn't think so. Ah, oh, fuck. All right, so here. Both locked. Oh, there's a staircase on the other side. I don't think I realized that. Okay. I have to go all the way, or I should have gone all the way around, but I can just cut through the middle. Save me a little bit of time. That makes sense, because I came into this room and never got to hug the other corners. So this room in front of me, I don't even know what's in here. Okay. I'm a dummy. None of you better be fucking alive, that's all I gotta say. King's bust. It's the bust of a kingly man dressed in armor. Oh. Present the king with his golden crown and defeat his loyal guards to open the way forward. Oh no. I don't want to have to fight those things, but I have to find his crown first anyways. Oh, but I will take this. Yeah, with all this health. Okay. So this room is a bust for now. <laughs> oh, I hate myself for saying that one. <laughs> oh, no. I'll do this one. Shit. They must be above me. <gasps> oh! Oh no, they were outside. That makes a whole lot of fucking sense. You are not number three. Baby. Oh, what? Oh, fuck yeah. This is my boomstick. Fuck yeah. Glad I came into this room. That scared me, but... <laughs> but the fact that it happened before I found the shotgun... I mean, after they found the shotgun, was fine. If I if I didn't find the shotgun first, that would have gone. That would have been pretty dicey. Ooh. Oh, you're gonna save some of that meat for me. Shoes. Little lot. Bootylicious. What's up, shoes? How you doing, dude? How'd stream go? What? Yo. <laughs> good, I'm doing good. That was fucking funny. Slay ammo and health drink. Okay. <laughs> that dude just wants to come down and bite me, and I'm just like, nah. Go over here first. More pistol ammo. Oh. Safe point. It was good. I ended early to spend some time with Lady Shoes because she's sick. Oh, that's not good. I hope she feels better real soon. Oh, there's two of you. Cool. Oh, now there's only one of you. Oh. 
I swear there used to be people here. <laughs> All right, we made it to the second floor. Unsolved environmental puzzles can be reset by exiting, re-entering an area. Oh, good to know. Before we do that right away, let's uh, let's clear this floor out. There's quite a bit to look around here, and I can unlock that side too. So actually, we'll hook. We'll start to the right. <sighs> I don't know what you're for. I'm not gonna touch you anymore. It's an old grandfather clock. There's a keyhole that could be used to unlock the face covering. Okay, well, I don't have that yet. Oh, it's the spade key. Imagine getting headshot with a shotgun. That did suck. Oh, and that's the club door. Okay, well. Platform is stuck in the shaft. Maybe I could throw something heavy down there to dislodge it. Yep, well, I know it's gonna go down there. Bing. Stuck in the shaft and dislodge it, just fall into the bottom. Oh, so now it's in the basement or something, right? It's a weird spot. Um I didn't go down this way yet. Clear out this little area. Oh, that's the other side of the club door. That makes sense. That's that whole spot there. Okay. Came in from the first one. Check the second. Yeah, this is why is that there? Because it's, it's a window. This is the door I came in on. For, wait. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, okay. Oh, Lady in Red, thank you so much for the lurk. I hope you're doing well. Uh. Every single face is the same face. And I think that's by that's on purpose, because it's supposed to be a nightmare. Death is the only way out. Ooh, that's not cool. I think I'll just live, please. Or at least try. Check this room. Ah. Right in the middle. Oh boy. God, I hope you're dead. You're not. All right, we know what we have to do here. Seems like a waste of shotgun shells, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I'd rather take their heads off now than before they stand back up. Nothing on down here. Yeah, I'll be right with you with whatever that is. Fucking wrecked him. Got some health drink. <coughs> Fuck you. Piece of shit. Oh, who's so fucking funny now, huh? I can't do it. I wouldn't be able to shoot him. God damn it. <laughs> Well played. <laughs> What's up, Disconnected? Welcome in. <laughs> Cynthia, welcome in. <clears throat> Thanks for freeing me from that washing machine. Who knows how long I would have been stuck in there if you hadn't have come along. I saw something shiny in the machine, and I went in to get it, but the lid closed on me, and I couldn't get back out. I managed to get the shiny thing that was inside. Since you saved me, I'll give it to you. Here, take it. Maybe you could find a use for it. Large coin. Yep, alright. 
Oh, it's one of those for that puzzle. Interesting. Excellent cat voice. Thank you. <laughs> Obviously trying to be Thackeray Binks. I join in and all I hear is fuck you. <laughs> No, it was about the cat. Tried to scare me. Alright, we'll do this one next. No, he won't. <laughs> How about this guy? A. No. Oh, we got two lively ones and two laying down ones. Oh, hey, that's not fair. Easy. Now let's see. Oh, health drink. Ooh, we got trees coin. Nice. More shotgun ammo is always appreciated. More pistol ammo. Are we looking there? We have a lot. Nice. All right, and that is the end of that room. And that brings us back to unlocking this door to get back to the main foyer. Ayo. Nice work. All right, so we have two things for the coin-shaped incident, uh, indents, incidents. What the fuck, Jug? Hanging off this anime I'm watching, I'm becoming a nerd. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it. It sounds good. Which one are you watching? Alright, so an old farmer, tired from a day of hard labor, falls asleep under the shade of a tree while his loyal dog watches over him. So I would assume this is tree, this is farmer, and this is dog. Because the little dog is watching over him. Well, although I guess this could be the tree because it's up higher. Let's see. Though the dog's looking to the right. Very specifically looking to the right while the tree is just there. You know, for now. That's what we'll do. But at the end of the day... It's going to be these two swapping, and the farmer definitely goes here. Fairy tale? Nice. I've not specifically heard of that one, although I'm not really one to even take guesses, because I honestly don't know. I'm not very good with... Um, I don't really know much of anime, to be honest. I remember I watched something with Nox, and it was crazy. Um... Not, I wouldn't say crazy. It was, it was good. I actually enjoyed it. It was about a house that, like, floats around and stuff. And there's some kids that live with the dude that, that, that was his house or whatever. Pantry key, baby. All right. Let's see what boss I have to kill right here. Oh, I already read that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, what are you doing? Pantry key. Ah, uh, you found the key. Hurry and open the door. My collection is rotting away as we speak. Use the key to unlock the door. <laughs> Finally, I get back to work on adding fresh toys to my precious collection. <sighs> Fuck. You open the door and where it greets you as the ghastly set of mutilated bodies impaled on stakes. The pungent stench of rotten flesh bursts from the now open doorway and assaults your nose. Mysterious to the key has disappeared and there's no sign of the person that was locked inside of the room. Uh... What? Oh, that j that just happened. You look pretty fresh. What's that? The young man's been impaled on a wooden stake. Her expression is eerily peaceful despite the gruesome manner of death. She's clutching a coin in her hand. Take it? Yeah. <laughs> You pry the coin from her dead hands. A moment later, the anguished crying of a woman echoes throughout the pantry, and a cold chill runs up your spine as you sense a malicious presence in the center of the room. 
Oh my god. A fresh toy for my collection. Meat golem? Bro, what the fu- And he's fat? No! Oh no. I'm scary looking fuck, dude. Oh, I'm fucked. Oh my god. Oh. Well, that got bad really quick. Okay. So that's not good. All right. Fresh meat. Kill the meat golem in the campaign. Well, okay. He ate the pantry key, and now I have the pantry key again. Oh. It's gonna be for that. Yep. Mm-hmm. Oops. She scared the fuck out of me. Wrong button. Shotgun ammo, shotgun ammo, dynamite, pistol ammo. Jesus. And there's nothing else to do with her or any of these other pieces. Oh boy. Okay. So we have the old man coin now. So that's good. And I think I want to go. Oh, all the way straight through. That's right. That's right. I remember. Oh. Nope. Not there. I'm a silly head. I was looking in the wrong spot, probably. Yep, I was. Yeah, I want to go through the kitchen. But the wrong... I, I was going in the right vector. Or not vector. Line. But I was going in the wrong direction. There we go. Okay. Fucking got it. Let's go. Ooh, it's the club key. And we have club key right around the corner, right? I think. Was it upstairs or? That's the spade key. I remember seeing that. Yeah, it was upstairs. Okay, cool. I'll just take the stairs. Fuck it. So apparently if there's no enemies in the vicinity, um, then you don't have to worry about stamina, because I'm sprinting right now and there's nothing. Which is pretty cool, because it makes traveling a bit quicker then. All right, it was either way. Well, let's go through this way because it's over on the side. Uh, wrong button. Oh, okay. That key I had is specific. Oh. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Okay. Clock key. Nice. That's right outside. Pull cues. Two pull cues are positioned in a way that resemble clock hands. One cue is pointing towards a two, while another cue broken in half, pointing towards an eight. Good to know. Okay. So that means it would be eight ten. That's what I'm gathering out of that. Glad I looked at that.
And they're different. They're separate rooms, actually, too. That's interesting. So I'll go in there, but while I have 810 on the brain. Um, lock key. There we go. Unlocks that. Spade key. Let's go. Right. Use the club key to unlock this room. What the fuck is that? It's a wall of sea. Shit. We can, uh, we can be cool. Servant's note added, okay. Lord William has been acting unusual as of late. He's been spending all of his time in the basement. Lady Irma has fallen into a deep depression over his strange behavior. It all seems to have started after he asked me and a few other servants to install a wardrobe over a large hole in the basement. In weeks afterwards, it's almost like he has become a different person, aloof and quick to anger. Lord William has ordered us to meet him in the basement again tomorrow night. I wonder what strange task he'll have to have us do this time, oh boy. I think you need the acid for that. That's probably a good point. Thank you, booty. It's a what? Did you say Wallacey? I, I did say Wallacey. How close can I get before you get annoying? All right, so it's cool, I guess, for now. Oh, Meg's here. Hello, Meg. Hope you're doing swell today, friend. Hello. I still don't know what the point of this fucking stepladder is. <laughs> oh, yes, I do. The fucking window. This is like Chip's challenge shit. This is easy. See? Now look at this shit. Fucking easiest puzzle yeah, ever. Some of that meat for me, I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> One more. Boom. Climb through the vent? Yes. He's grunting. Oh, yeah. Yeah, baby. What do we find here? Another one's in here, right? Oh, okay, cool. This is the room that was locked. Shotgun ammo. Jar of linoleum. Ooh, that's important. And we'll take a save there. All right, we'll just unlock this door. What the fuck happened out there? Oh fuck, what happened out here? Where did you all come from? You the last one? Maybe there's one more after you? I don't know. There is one more. <laughs> nope. There's two more. Yo, bro. <laughs> Fuck you too, make me waste fucking shells. Dickhead. Now, where's this last one? I came from always oh, around this corner, okay. It's just standing there, huh? Where did they fucking come from? Alright, so this whole place is good. Creature in hole. Here.
Why does this look like there's stuff in here still? Look on the map, it... Oh no, it only... It does, okay. So it just, it turns the room green that you're currently in. Alright, that makes more sense. I'm like, why are they clearing that room? I mean, this hallway, but not the that random room there. Okay, so we have... Jar of Lanolim. Oh, the, um, we have the spade key now. That is first floor, other side. Yeah. Going there. They'll probably get it. Maybe they'll get us to the stairs on the other side to get up over there on the other wing. Bet you that's it. Unlocked with spade key. Oh, hi. Thanks for opening wide for that one. Ooh. Cool. All right. So the two doors here. Oh, that's the fleshy stuff. I need the acid for that. Then what the fuck's the other creature? More of these fuckers? Man, there's a lot of you in here. Hexagon shaped hole. Let's turn the mechanism with a hexagonal shaped hole. Oh, that's the fucking crown I need. Interesting. In a square shaped hole. Okay. Huh. All right, interesting. That will be important. And now we'll go this way. What's going on here, pals? What the fuck? Do they have guns? Ow! They do, they have fucking guns! Matata! Fucking all those shots hidden. Alright, I'm gonna take a drink. Oh, that was a good shot. <laughs> can I take your. Oh, I can. Yeah, I was like, please give me your ammo. That'd be nice. Another keyhole. Oh, square shaped. Okay. Well, I wasn't expecting an actual gunfight in this game, so that was interesting. Yo, Goth, what's up? Thank you so much for the lurk. Hope you're having a lovely evening. Nothing here. Oh! You motherfuckers! Are we seriously doing that right now? Holy fuck. I forget what those things are called, but fuck that. Piece of shit. Oh. Do you too? <laughs> I 
And there ain't a single fucking pickup item in here at all. Bro. What was the point of this? Oh, well, there's the door over here. I didn't see that. And also, there is the, um, the square keyhole down there. So there's something. Mimics, thank you. Oh, fuck. Hello. Yep, this is the whole different wing now. Okay. Need a diamond key for that one. And a key to unlock the wardrobe. Interesting. Oh. The tapping body of a middle-aged woman lays sprawl on top of the bed. A trail of blood is leading from the body to a bloody wardrobe. Ooh. Jar of aquaverum. Uh... I'm gonna take that and go over here now. Cool. Awesome. Okay. What has happened to my husband? It's almost like William has become a completely different person. Now he even spends his nights down in the basement. I can't remember the last time we slept in the same bed together. We barely even speak to each other anymore. Even more worrying, some servants have gone missing and strange things have been happening around the manor. Just like last night, I heard a horrid breathing sound coming from the wardrobe. It came up all night. I tried to tell William about it, but he just ignored me and walked away. I'm beginning to fear for my life. I can't live like this anymore. Well, uh, you're not, so... Yeah, what key do I need for this? It's probably just a bloody wardrobe key, they'll probably end up calling it. Alright, to the left. Let's take let's take care of this trash really quick. Another one around the corner, maybe? Yep. Oh yeah, keep walking. Alright, I'll just go in here. Oh, oh, I have a lockpick. I have one of those. Got it from that fucking mimic. Aha! Pistol, shotgun, shotgun, health. And a quick little save. Nice. Alright, we're doing good, we're doing good. This next door is over here to the right. All right, this is gonna bring us back out into the foyer. Perfect. Back in. I think it's just this door I haven't touched. Yes. And it is unlocked. Get out of here. Oh, I could step on them. Okay, that's fine. Make sure you stretch out those creamy hamstrings. Oh, I shall, Cynthia, but but first I really want to just dip my hands into this filthy toilet. Phil is clogged with disgusting filth. The stench coming from it is extremely pungent. There's there something stuck in the toilet. Reach in and get it. Hell yeah, brother. Oh! Square crank. Let's go. Ew. Alright. Stretch break time, though. Oh, yeah. Oh. Woo. <laughs> Stop it. Okay. So, we've cleared out this top space outside of the bloody wardrobe and the diamond key. Um, oh, over here is the square peg. I have to go over here through the door where the uh, monks were, or cultists, I guess we can call them. And I'll go downstairs and wrap around to the square peg. And then down there is the other square peg I need to use also. Yep, right here. Hey. 
Hell yeah. Oh, we have all three of those now. We have the Jar of Aquavarum, Lanolim, and Odazon. That's on the first floor. Which, we are on the first floor now. We'll just head back through everything. Think of where the, uh... Flesh wall. Yes, the square, that's where the other one is. Is on the other side of that wall, actually. Perfect. Do, 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 do. Okay, this one is the hexagon, so I don't want that. But the square one I can do. How am I gonna make that work? There's a dark discoloration here underground and here that something used to sit on this spot. Do I have to push everything down? Is that what it is? Well, I can't get over that way. Then I don't know how to rotate something. That's the problem. And why did this piece of the wall come jutting out like that? It was very strange. I can't. <sighs> That's okay. It resets anyways once I leave the room. <laughs> I don't have the other key anyways. So why don't we go to... Pailed body... Oh, the mixing station's here. Okay. So we gotta go all the way through here. I'll be back for you with that acid. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Gotta say, we're doing pretty good in terms of progress in this game. Fucking flying right through it. Yeah, right through. Okay. Wait. Why haven't I done this yet? I'm insane. How did I forget? How did I just not pay attention to those? Okay. Oh, I can't relook at notes apparently. Okay, that's fucking fine. Some good acid right there. I will take the jar of acid, thank you very much. Okay, I will cut across again. This little cheeky save. straight across. Yeah. Cool. It's a wall made of strange fleshy growth. Maybe I could dissolve it with something. Hell yeah, you can, brother. Take this here jar acid. See ya. Ooh, the diamond key. Health. Pistol ammo. Nice. Okay. So the diamond one, I think, is upstairs on my side yes so I just need to go around in a big circle basically good uh, 
<laughs> okay, now here. Oh, I went to the right. Hello? Who are you? Oh. Alright, well, I mean, first off, yikes. Second off, that man canoed his head <laughs> in the wrong direction from whence he's shot. But uh, I'll just take your cabin key and your your note here. To my dearest Lucy, know that this letter will probably never reach you, but I have to at least leave something behind, if only to give me a peace of mind before I do what I must what must be done. I don't know how many days or even weeks it's been since I've been trapped in this horrid place. I remember falling asleep beside you only to wake up in a nightmare, a nightmare that never ends. As I sit here prepared to take my own life, I wonder if I will finally wake up to find myself next to you in bed. Oh. Or if I will enter my eternal sleep, never to see you again. I love you, Lucy. Pray for me. Oh, like a juicy burp on that one, too. Oh. All right, well... I'll take your magnum while you're at it. No shit. I don't think there's anything else in this room. So let's uh let's reorder some stuff here. So survival knife could be two. Sounds I mean one. Pistol would be two, magnum will be three, shotgun will be four. Large rubber hanger that fires powerful magnum rounds, which can pierce through targets, has a maximum ammo capacity of five. All right, so it's probably at the same distance as the pistol. Got it. Okay. Ooh, magnum. <laughs> eh. All right, so we got that done. We got to. Oh, um, we did the diamond. The diamond key already. Oh, yeah, the cabin key. That's what we got to do. Oh, straight ahead. This is where the doggos were. Okay, here's the cabin. Hello? Drunken man. See a drunken man drinking from a bottle. His eyes are sunken in, and there is a haunted, tired look on his face. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Thank you, Tree, for the pits. I see this hard place is claimed to another victim. Before you ask, I've no idea what this place is or I got here. I'm probably the same as you. Woke up here after going to sleep. After getting chased by some rabid dogs, I managed to escape in this cabin and lock myself in. Imagine my surprise discovered the cabin was filled with boxes of booze. If I'm gonna meet my end in this place, I definitely don't want to be sober when it happens. The drunk man paused to take a drink from his bottle. Someone tried to get inside earlier, slamming the door, begging to be left in, and I ignored him. Knowing I was going to open the door with all those monsters outside, pretty sure those dogs got him. What, he what, did. What, 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 what. The hard screams, they ripped him apart like a squealing pig mixed with a crying baby. Something I'll never be able to forget. What, 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 what. I'm probably next. We still have this booze to keep me comfy before I die. Okay. What else is in here, bro? A health drink, pistol ammo. Oh, hexagon crank. That's good. Oh no! Look at his face. <gasps> the door. The door. Oh! Ready. <laughs> Where are the Oh fuck! The monk. There's another one.
Oh, yeah, dude, you got fucking dumped on. Oh. Absolutely fucking run. Ooh, okay. I'm getting hot in this fucking hoodie. Oh, you got Noxley's shirt on today. Huh. I forgot I did that. Oh, pardon me. Oh, oh, my knee fucking hurts today. Uh, okay. Nothing else in this place, really. But, I mean, we got what was important. Ooh, that fucking hexagon key. He's dead. Oh! Alright. So, time to go use the hexagon key. Oh, fuck. There are more guards. I have to come up this way. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> thank you for the pistol ammo. More pistol ammo. Got lots of pistol ammo. Man, to charge it before firing. Hold left mouse to charge. Release left mouse before charge to cancel firing. Oh, so it's like a wind-up shot. Interesting. There's gonna be more dickheads in here, aren't there? Nope. Must be the one safe room in the whole fucking place. It's got music in it, at least. Alright. So, we gotta go back in this direction here. It's the first floor. Grab that all. They bring it over here, but how are we still going to take care of that creature in the wall? I still don't know what to do there. Oh, damn dirty Harry. <laughs> yeah. This is the right way. Okay. Okay, so that's the thing that rotates it. Got it. So I need to move this up by one. <sighs> then I use the square to push him out. Perfect. Now we push him all the way up. Perfect, and now hexagon rotates them. Oh, we have to do it a second time. So now he's looking in the correct direction for where that spot is. Now we push him all the way over until he's lined up perfectly, and then push him. One more push. Let's go. Give me the crown, bitch. Nice. Glizzy the Demon. Now that is a fucking name I can get behind. Welcome to the mob. Hope you're doing well. If, you, uh, if you're a chatter, uh, I always ask, um, how did you find us in this corner of the internet? If you're more of a lurker and like just kind of chill and do your thing, Enjoy. Thank you for the follow. Again, welcome to the mob. Happy to have you. That puts us at 995 followers. Five away from a thousand. What the fuck? Nightmare? Oh, were you looking up um, Nightmare of Decay for streams? Okay, so now I need to go all the way over. Handle, I have to put the crown there. The thing is, I don't know what the creature in the hole is all about. You know, let me go see if I can interact with it. 
I just saved it, so it's fine. And look at Bon Search, yes. Nice. Well, glad to hear that, that Twitch recommended me to, for, for that. And, uh, and thank you for giving me a shot. Appreciate you. Uh, yes, it is that one. Okay. Who is Booty? Alright. There's a fleshy growth involved with a large hole in the center. A creature with glowing red eyes is peering out of the hole. Hello, stranger. Would you mind doing a favor for me? Do a favor for the creature in the hole? Sure. Thank you, stranger. I tried asking others, but they would only scream and run away at the moment I greeted them. How rude. You see, I've been having to collect a few minutes. The tortured expression of death in their faces filled with great joy. This creepy don't do that? <laughs> is flawed. I've recently realized that something is missing. All of the heads in my collection are male, and I have no female heads. I wish to correct this imbalance. So this is the dude that causes all the problems. Because remember we saw in our the apartment that zombie guy was holding a decapitated woman's head. If you could bring me three female human heads, and place them on the tray I provided. I will reward you for your troubles. Offerings to the creature in the hole can be placed in this tray. All right, well, if I find a, um, a female human's head, I'll uh, be right back with that. How did you do that? You had a devil? No, no. <laughs> um, okay, so I need to go back down. I might as well take the stairs. That would make most sense. It's right here. Is this guy a lozenge? <laughs> no, I thought actually I was, was fine. Beating the shit out of his ball bag. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. Dougie's just talented. I wouldn't go that far, but thank you. I have some kinks that I want to like share with you so we can like do these things. I'm okay, and they're like, I, I have a fun finish. And this is actually, this is Knoxler's shirt, by the way. He's a good buddy of mine who also streams. He's a horror variety streamer. Okay, so this is going to get rough because I know once I put this thing on this dude's head, these things are apparently going to come to life and I'm going to have to fight them. Let's see. Door locked too. That's fucking bad. Oh no. Joking about save some of that meat for me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Blah, la, la. Sword axe and bow? Oh no. I'm Fox. And maybe not. Woo! Woo Ice Snow Wolf Cold. That is that's an interesting name. I like it though. I like the the cold bitterness. Well, Ice Snow Wolf Cold, welcome into the mob. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. Um, if you are a chatter. I always like to ask people how they found us here in this little corner of the internet. Um, if you're more of a lurker, that's cool too. My disappointment <laughs> is immeasurable. <laughs> and my day is ruined. And my day is ruined. Oh no, why is your day ruined? <laughs> All right, so that went pretty well. I don't have any more Magnum. Or shotgun shells left. I got plenty of pistol shots. So what's in here? It's an elevator? Oh, to go to the basement. 
Okay. That makes more sense. I'm like, why the hell? Health drink. Lord's Diary. We finally moved to the new manor. Irma was against it, but I managed to convince her. I'm sure she'll fall in love with this place in no time at all. It also helped that the price for the manor was dirt cheap. Something about horrific murders in the past and it being haunted, but I don't care. I was drawn to this manor from the first moment I laid eyes on it, almost as if it was calling out to me. That's not good. So he met the thing in the wall too. This is my answer why having a bad day, can you pause it? <laughs> the bird. I was waiting. I'm like, it's gonna be something good. Yeah, suck it, bitch. <laughs> Oh wow, this is a whole setup. Damn. Oops. Seguasuga bug were hilarious. Awesome. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Change holding the closing. I have some kinks that I want to like share with you so we can like do these things. I'm okay, and they're like, I have a foot pad. He does. He has a foot fetish. Nothing wrong with that. But he's just in denial. Oh, why am I get Tree. Did I do a big circle? It did. Burn, 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 burn. Okay, KC is too cheap to be honest. Oh yeah, that's the locked door, that's right. Okay, so I have two spots I can go. This door, we'll try here. Boo, 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 boo. <laughs> Bad song, it's a great song. Uh-oh. Fuck. Alright, another door down here. There's a whole other fucking world down here. Jesus. Goddamn labyrinth. Locked from the other side. We ain't going that way, folks. Oh, is there anything on this dude? No. <clears throat> Wheeler, who else played um for uh, with the with the Sangi boys? Uh you what? Ain't going down there. Stuck bolt cutters. God damn it. It's a pair of bolt cutters stuck in the ground under a fleshy growth. There may be some way to dissolve the do I have more acid? I don't think I do. No, I don't. Fuck, so I have to make more somehow. Or maybe I'll just find one somewhere. That'd be pretty cool too. Castrator, Immolation, Caddy D. Oh, is this another game? Ooh. Where's my pelican? Try to highest scores possible within the allotted time. Score points by hitting targets. Headshot score double. Time could be extended by hitting the blue target. Prizes are unlocked for reaching various score amounts. Yep. So we've got 100, 180, and 250. That's a big old med pack. And is that supposed to be like a, a fast reloader for the Magnum? Maybe just ammo for the Magnum. That's definitely pistol, shotgun. Oh. Fuck. Fuck. 
So they do eventually go down on their own. Interesting. Fuck. No. No. Fuck. I think I needed one. I needed a big score. I don't think I'm gonna get it this first try. Fuck. Look at that. Fuck. I'll take the six over the four, thanks. I am a machine. I think we need like 250. Fuck. Oh, I was so close. Oh, I thought I got it 209. Oh, I need 250. Damn. Woo, all right. So the fours go down, the sixes in the front row and the 10 in the back row, they seem to stick around. And then the blue um, time increaser keeps going too. They don't seem to drop. See, that's the problem. Fuck, dude. Jesus, it took forever. Oh, my God. I'm not doing any better. Yeah, I'm doing terrible this time. I keep going for the fours. I really shouldn't be. Need 250. It's not gonna fucking happen. Lined up, you son of a bitch. Oh, fuck. Oh. I'm gonna get it. Bullshit.
Oh, you fucker. Double fucker. Yo, fat stuffs, what's up, dude? Welcome in. How are we today? Are you feeling a little bit better today? Come on, baby. This is the one. I got it. Let's go. Get that high score, baby. Let's break 300. Fuck. Ooh. Broke 300. Let's go. Broke 315. There we go. My strength back now. Most of the sickness is gone. Let's go, dude. Glad to hear it. It was Magnum ammo. Okay. Alright, back to reload the shotgun. Let's reload the Magnum. Pistol's already good to go. And then the other thing is a fucking <clears throat> melee weapon. Okay. So I need to get acid for that thing here. Over here to the l oh shit. I don't want to go down there yet. <laughs> but I have to, I think. The fucking sewer, great. There won't be anything gross and dangerous down here. Nope. Not at all. Not at all. Fuck. Oh, he's behind me! Motherfucker! No idea how someone got behind me, but that's fine. Oh, what the fuck? Shit. Ah, save those. Let's do a quick little heal. Or a large, I don't need to use that yet. We'll just use a health drink. Okay. Door there, and... Oh, well. Wake up, dude. And good night. Oh, this goes up to another ladder spot. Interesting. What was this back here? Let me do this first. More sewer. This man looks like he's naked. Hairy man ass. Huh. Oh. Oh, damn. Two good fucking hits there. Got him. Anything down here I can collect? No? Okay. in this door oh my god dynamite pistol pistol shotgun we got a crowbar we got another empty jar another first aid kit with a barrel of acid well because I don't have to make any more I can just uh, you know fill it up that's cool love to see it thank you coolest fucking closet I've seen this whole game 
to get back and hit this door. Shit, nice indeed, huh? Alright. Now we're gonna go back we're gonna go up this ladder now to another part, the basement. Ah good safe spot. Fuck, okay. So we gotta go get the uh we have to get the bolt cutters first. That is a definite. I'm gonna do a bit of backtracking here. That's okay. Cause I've already cleared this whole spot out. Up this ladder. And you can't use the crowbar on it. You have to use the bolt cutters. Um, which over to the right. And covered by this fleshy stuff which I have to use the acid on that I just got. Boom, bolt cutters. Yeah, I was thinking about trying the crowbar, but it said I had to specifically uh, dissolve it. I'm sorry, not, yeah, not dissolve it. I had to cut them, I think it said the term was, so I was like, oh. Who knows, I'll try it with the crowbar anyways, just for S's and G's. To uh, a yeah, crowbar. Middle bar in the shape of a crow's beak, slow to swing, but it hits hard and deals blunt damage, which is effective at crushing bones. Oh, it's a uh, it's a melee weapon, so it would not have helped at all. <laughs> Alright, cool. Just a weapon. Yeah, just a weapon. What the fuck is going on here? There's another one somewhere. Ooh, okay, I see it. I Well, I could hear it. Oh, I can't reach it though. Oh, that sucks. I just can't, just can't see it. It's right down in there. Oh, well. I'm down the rusty ladder? Sure, and I bet you it breaks as I go down. Fuck. You know, I'm just realizing I probably didn't want to shoot that thing yet. I think I needed to use it to kill whatever the fuck is starting up a fucking chainsaw. Oh my god. What the fuck, dude? Oh, he needs a sprinter. Daddy's home was right. Holy fuck. Oh, I didn't resave. Okay, I have to go back and get the fucking bolt cutters. I didn't f fucking save it. I will this time, though. Okay. Here's the acid. And then we call crowbar number one. Bolt cutters, we just use them. What's up, demonic? How you doing, man? We're just, uh... Oh, we're playing Nightmare of Decay, which has basically been very similar to Resident Evil 1, but it's been enjoyable.
Yeah, I never actually looked right here. Where did this go to? Oh. Well, fuck. Okay. I mean, why else would I want to get down there, though? Like, there's a boss guy I have to fight down there, but... It's, it doesn't look like it's being super helpful at the moment. Let's check out the rest of the spot over here to the right. Good guy got playing done some DVD. Nice. Looks a lot like Resident Evil. Yeah. But it's like I basically went to sleep. And, um... <clears throat> I woke up in this nightmare. And the guy who was here before me said he, there's a drunk guy in this cabin saying the same shit. Oops, there we go. Hello? Hey, lady. She's still alive? That bitch took fucking two shotgun blasts straight to the face and a third that was like, kind of. Insane woman. It's the body of an insane woman. Even in death, she has a manic smile on her face. Remember that the creature in the whole one of female heads for its collection. Take her head? Yes. Got a head of insane woman. Usually nice to cut off and take her head. There's the head. <laughs> Soma. Hello, friend. Okay, well, that was fun. <laughs> let's uh, let's take another health drink. Nice. Oh, someone say head. <laughs> oh God, Soma. <laughs> so good to see you again. Good to hear from you too. I, uh, I definitely enjoyed vacation last week, but it feels good to be back. Even though it's only two nights this week, it's still good. I'm sorry, what the fuck noise is that? Oh no, do I have to shoot dogs again? I don't want to shoot dogs again. Damn it. That sucks. I don't like that. I mean, I get it. It's it's from like it's they're zombies. They're not actual doggos anymore. They don't have to use the goddamn cry noise at the end of it. Fucking bastards. Do is naked. Yo, Mr. Rope, Guthrie the man. How you doing? I need another key for another goddamn wardrobe that I haven't unlocked yet. Fuck. But I came all this way for that. Ugh. Let's see. <laughs> oh, yeah, I gotta bring that the head to the creature. I'm good if I'm able to watch a stream on my laptop. Nice. We'll go back up through the elevator. I'll come back and kill the boss later when I have more ammo. It kept disconnecting me from video chat so it could even stream on my own internet. That's weird. 
Um, okay, so I gotta find the creatures upstairs on the right side. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take a left. Go up the stairs. And his ass is tucked away in the corner. Look what I have for you, friend. I have the head of an insane woman. Wait. Oh, three. Shit, I gotta fucking kill two more women? That's not good. I mean, hopefully they're murderous and evil, so I doesn't feel that bad. Shit. Alright, so... I guess I really don't have another choice. I have to kill that boss. I don't think I have anything else that can progress me further. We've opened all the club key doors, bolt cutter doors. Pranks have been used. Diamond key has been used. Oh, I can throw dynamite? Oh. Okay. Speed key we've used. Just a melee weapon. Okay. So yeah, we definitely have to kill that boss so he can give me something I need. Boo -doo -boo -boo. Back down to the basement we go. I just can't fucking believe that we're at 996 followers right now. Four followers away. What the fuck? Ellery. Okay, we get down here. Got it. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Yep, left. I'm going to go over to the right when I get in here. I can go save it again so that when I die here a lot, at least everything I've just done doesn't have to get redone. Voila. All right. Let's try to kill this bastard, huh? I'm just going to escape to skip it. Oh, this isn't good. Okay, so that's not good at all. <laughs> oh, fuck. So I think I shoot him once, and then... Like, it looked like something came out of his back, and I have to shoot that instead. One of those weakness spot monsters. I forgot to reload that fucking thing. Yes! Let's go. Alright. Pistol ammo. Bloody wardrobe key, okay. We have two of those to check, actually. There's one upstairs, too. He's, uh, he's had some fun down here, this guy. Lots of fun, actually. Well, unfortunately, your time here is at an end, and I can't even use your chainsaw. Zero to ten. 
All right, we out. Um, that bloody word is all the way over. That's right. Okay. Just turns back on. The gate didn't lower. Or go back up to this. All right, cool. Whatever. I didn't fucking use those. I think we were supposed to shoot that if he was near it. And then it'd make him, like, expose his weak spot. But whatever. That worked for me. <laughs> I mean, I'm all out of magnum shots. I'm all out of shotgun shots. I got three things of dynamite. The left mouse before releasing the charge for the amount of throwing force. Cancel the throw by right clicking. Okay. Two power attacks for the crowbar by holding down left mouse. There's one. Then holding. Oh. Okay. Cool. All right, so the bloody wardrobe's over here. There's another one upstairs. Oh, there's something good in here. What the fuck? Okay, I'm just gonna climb through this large hole. Bugs. Oh, god damn it. The cat's back. Hello again, stranger. I didn't think you would make it this far. You're tougher than I thought. Or maybe just lucky. Either way, I don't think you'll be able to survive for much longer down here in the dungeons. Some truly monstrous beasts lurk around down here, and I'm pretty sure one of them will get you. Good luck, stranger. You'll need it. Alright, he's not as rude as he was the first time I met him. That's something. Pistol ammo is the one thing I got. Great. We covered a large, man-sized hole in the wall in the basement. I crawled through the hole and was astonished to discover a massive underground dungeon on the other side. That's maybe thousands of years old, and I can just ima imagine the ancient treasures that lay within. I've ordered the servants to cover up the hole with the wardrobe and watch them as they work to make sure none of them got curious and crawled through. No one else knows about the dungeon. I plan to keep it that way. All right, let's see what's down here. That was a little easy. Smashes on facing against the wall. Oh, just more zombies. Not that I have a ton of ammo for this, but... Run over the bugs. Squish, squish. <laughs> Must be another guy in here. Or not. Oh, fuck! Jesus Christ! Ho ho ho! Hello. They weren't kidding, there were some seriously weird beasts down here. Holy fuck. Oh, the bugs respawned. Interfering the key to unlock this door. Alright, cellar doors locked. What about down here? Don't you dare to 
Oh, that's the friends. Yeah, fuck him up, dude. Oh no. I don't know what that is, but it looks important. I couldn't run out to save him. All right, that's fine. Ah, <sighs> well. Cellar key. Oh, we have a new note. Lord's Diary 3. How many days has it been since I discovered this dungeon? I don't remember anymore. Irma asked me about what I've been doing in the basement. But there's no L teller. I won't tell anybody. This is my secret alone. Something calls me down here and I don't and I won't rest until I find it. Save that shortly. I'm just gonna go and grab the ammo. I've been shot to death. No shit. I don't know if I want to follow that guy yet. I still have to go check the other thing back upstairs. I think there's more to look at. Yeah, before I go back that way. Because I feel like that's getting close to... Not end game, but it's progressing quickly. And well, that's the cellar door, too, which I have a key for that. First, I'll do this. Back to the large hole. Heh. Climb on through to the other side. Do, 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 do. All right. Sadly, that's not a very quick way to get back up this way, but I figured I'd just do it now. Before I forget. Here, straights, okay. Doing good though. God. It's almost already one. Oh wait, I started at 10 today, that's right. Okay, I'm like, what the fuck? Like how is it already almost one o'clock? But that makes sense. We may not get to last lesson tonight though. Having said that, that's okay. Okay, so I need to, where am I going to again? Uh, oh, bloody wardrobe key. Yes. Where's that? Bloody wardrobe. Nice. Second floor left side. I'm completely opposite side. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Eh. Every time I come through this room, I should save it. It's a good practice. And then from here, second on the right, I have a filthy toilet. I forgot about that. Gross. Okay. Oh, now, yeah, there's definitely going to be a guy in here. That's right. I don't know why I'm doing this. Oh. The creature psycho with the chainsaw attacked in the basement, appearing you from inside the bloody wardrobe with a manic smile on his face. He doesn't seem to be a hostile at the moment as I fucking shot him. Sorry, dude. I see you had fun with her, though. That's cool. Bye. Okay. Well. And I can go all the way across and feed this other head to the creature. It's two out of three. Awfully quiet around these parts now. All these puzzles are resolved. Well, except for you. I here take ahead of a middle-aged woman. 
ghastly expression alludes to the horrific manner of her death. Well, there you go. Yeah, you're welcome. Be back in a bit. I mean, more than likely, at least. Alright, go back down to the first. And hit the elevator. Which is... Down to the left, far side. Twy! Welcome in, my friend. How are you? Hope you are well this evening. We're playing some uh, survival horror indie goodness that is uh, very, very similar to Resident Evil 1. I'll save it here. Actually, I didn't need to do that, but that's fine. Actually, I'm going to go in the cellar door first. Unlock that. Uh, I do need to go both ways, that's for sure. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. Fuck. Oh, wait, yeah, no, that's right. I have to watch the large hole I have to climb through. Right. Okay, now... Now we're back in the dungeon. Wish I could jump that. All the way across. To the cellar door. Let's check it out. What's in the cellar? It appears to be flooded. That's not good. Well, that's not good. No more behind me, right? That fucked me last time that happened. I'm good, Twy. Just, you know, headshot and zombies like it's my job. Um, no, I'm doing good, honestly. Ooh, we got more. No. We got more shotgun ammo. Oh, perfect timing. Hi. One. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh shit! I almost fucked that up. Naked man, go away! We are running out of bullets fucking fast. Not many people want to give me more. Oh, more shotgun. Health drink. Jesus Christ, what are you? Other than being a big old bitch. Oh God, oh God, oh God, I can't move. Run. I need health. Fuck, no. Need health. Okay, good. Whew. Ooh, okay. So I panicked big time there. Hope you all didn't just notice that obviousness. His hand grew back. How the fuck did his head grow back? This is bad. Well, that's not how that was supposed to go. 
Thanks, Meg. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, so... Let's not go to the cellar yet. God, that was bad. <laughs> Alright, so you're definitely not going that way first. We will go the other direction. And follow the guy with the silver platter. <clears throat> so instead of going, uh, uh, bypassing the stairs and going to the uh, cross, Crypt, or the cellar. Crypt. Um, I'll go back down here. Oh, and there's a safe spot right here, too, so. Be one step closer after the next time I die. Alright, so this dude ran in here. What is that? Circular slot. I don't have a circular one. We'll take this though. Thank you. Oh, fuck no. No, 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 no. No, no. Why do they have to be giant fucking spiders? Oh. There's fucking chittering around. Oh, God. Oh. My man's is taken off. <laughs> All right, so that's where I definitely need to go, but the rest of here I can still check out, right? Circular slot, circular, okay, maybe not really. I mean, there's two other places I can check out. Actually, what is, why is this a blank? All right, maybe there's one place I can check out. All right, let's do that first. Better not wake back up when I come back in here. Oh, I see. And that's all square slots to get over there. Circular slot to get there. All right, but what's here? <gasps> you see a heavily wounded man laying against the wall. He's just barely clinging on to life. Please. Please, listen to me. There's a monstrous beast in the caves beyond that door. I tried to escape from it, but it was too fast. If you see it, don't try to fight it. J just run. Run from the beast. He has succumbed to his wounds. Should I have to kill him in case he... Alright, well, let's see what's on this side. A monstrous beast. Well, there's a couple of beasts here. Oh, okay. Well, those are important kills for sure. Oh, I'll take that win.
It sounds like someone has some type of melee weapon and they are swinging for the fucking fences over here. Lower these barks the key that fits into the keyhole to get whatever that is. Health. Oh, more magnum. Okay, we did the big circle. Where am I? Oh yeah. Yep, okay. So room over in the corner to the right, big room, and then last room. Those skellies alone. This is the last room. I didn't see any big creature in here. Ooh. Okay. Oh no. It's a giant rabbit? You've got to be fucking kidding me. Oh, whoa. No. I have seen Monty Python and the Holy Grail. No. No! Things are not looking good here, friends. Yeah, fuck this. We gotta run. Oh my god, I shift tabs and it fucking opened an overlay. Where's the cat when you need it? No shit, huh? Yeah, so I really shouldn't try to fight that thing. That sucks. Oh, I have to redo all of that? There's no save part along there either. That sucks. Okay, whatever. I didn't come down here. I mean, I know it's down here, but I forgot to look. Uh, I definitely have to go that way.
I guess I should probably kill these fucking assholes over here before... Because if I don't kill them now, it's gonna be annoying as fuck. Well, let me handle this little bastard first. Fuck off. Wait, I have dynamite. That worked out swimmingly. Nice. Okay. Moving along. Maybe I can finally... I mean, I can kill this thing by myself. Now I have to deal with those fucking dickheads. I can also run if I need to. Also, I have dynamite, so I should probably... No, I shouldn't do that. That would be a waste. Now let's do it, bitch. Hello? Oh. <laughs> Fucking miss. Leave me alone! Shit, I forgot reload fucks me up. Slayer, kill the monstrous beast in the campaign. Key of the beast. I wonder where that goes. Uh, insane boss fight that was. Oh, this must be it. You have the fearsome visage of the beast. Yep. Sick. Magnum, first aid kit, and holy water. What's the holy water for? Flash filled with water that has been blessed with holy power can be thrown to produce a divine explosion that deals massive amounts of damage to the holy creatures of the nightmare. Oh, okay, so that's a, that's a one-time use specialty. Okay. Well... At least this guy knows that he didn't die in vain. He let me know what I needed to know. Got it done. See ya, dude. Okay. So that's done. That way is, I think, the next way I need to go. But I think I'm gonna go back and save it really quick, just so I don't have to redo that whole fucking part again. I don't, I don't have much for ammo, but should I take that fucking lead pipe? Okay.
Oh, fuck. I fucking forgot about that thing. Shit. That's him walking downstairs. There's another one around the corner? Fuck. Oh, please. 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 Oh. I've got three shots with a magnum and a fucking crowbar. I mean, I guess I have some dynamite too, but... Oh, no. Fuck you. I'm not gonna waste a magnum shot on you. Stinky ass bitch. God, don't tell me this is a boss fight right now. Yeah. I'm gonna have to use a magnum against him. Fuck, fuck, fuckity fuck, fuckity fucky fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, I walked into the wrong fucking room, huh? I can't escape. Give me the fucking... Oh, I'm gonna use the holy water on it for sure. Uh, let's do six. God, what else can I use? Oh, I have shotgun ammo. Fuck. Okay. <sighs> Jesus fucking Christ. Fuck you, asshole. Fuck you too, bigger asshole. Oh, this is not good. Fuck, yeah. Giant ass fucking piece of shit. So I got some silver discs out of that. <laughs> I don't have a circular crank. I don't have a square crank. Yeah, so there's nothing else I could do down here. I have to go save it and then go into the cellar, which was really fucking tough the last time we went in there. And I have basically no ammo. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, uh, not good. I don't put them here, do I? Oh, maybe it is. I guess not. Okay. It wouldn't be this, would it? You would think it'd be another crank, but I guess I'll try, you know? Oh. There's something evil down here and I fear that it has taken over my mind. The whispers tell me to commit horrible crimes, to kill the others in the manor. They get louder and louder every day and it's only a matter of time before I succumb. Give me Irma, I have doomed us all. Jesus. Golden tablet, okay. So that's where that goes. Well, what goes there, I should say. All right, now how many do I have? I have one more, two different areas. Let's see if I can get a good look and see what's in there. 
make a decision what I could use immediately. This one has health and magnum ammo. And this one has shotgun. Some other red thing. I, I, gotta, I gotta know what that red thing is. I, I can't. <laughs> Can't go on without it. And we know what that is. Shotgun ammo. Oh, it's dynamite. It looks kind of circular from this. Fucking not circular, but like almost like round. Damn it all. Could have used some pistol ammo. Or it was magnum ammo, actually. Which would have been good. Got those two open. Oh. Here we go. Um, only one more left to get. We go into that place. Okay, we're gonna go to the crypt. I have five fucking shells in a dream. Oh, I'm like, what else is there? It's just the fucking... What do you call it? It'd be cool if I could take it <laughs> and just bring it over to the other one. That would defeat the purpose. Alright. I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat this. This obviously enough... I don't think I have enough ammo. All right, to the cellar. Because this big fucking dude was down here, and I didn't know what to do with him. And I tried to run around him, and that was not a good idea, apparently. will have to be the wave until we get to big boy again. Oh. Yes, get that extra shotgun shell in there, please. Should have been doing that earlier and conserving my ammo. These little baby ones. Are they faster? No, they weren't that fast, but this dude's fast in here, on the other side. I can't break these ones. Health drink, more shotgun shells. So if you didn't already guess it, we gotta use a shotgun on this dude. It's all the ammo they gave us. Right there. That's not good. Let me go, let me go.
I guess that was enough to get around him. You have to shoot his limbs off. <laughs> oh my god. All right, take that first aid kit, and let's immediately take out um, the crowbar. There's a bunch of little dickheads pop up here, yeah? Cusp of that. Oh, that sucks. Please, I need more fucking ammo. I need health packs. I need fucking help. Thanks, I guess. Old newspaper clipping. Mass murder at Haunted Manor. Irma Herdshaw, wife to prominent businessman William Herdshaw, and their many live-in servants have been found murdered at a manor known to locals as being haunted. Bodies of the servants were brutally mutilated, and Irma Herdshaw was found decapitated in her bed. William Herdshaw, the main suspect of this heinous crime, has gone missing and is believed to be on the run. Nah, he dead. He dead. That's how I get back. That way. What's over here? I must know. Oh, the last silver desk, of course. Oh, I need to have some more health drink. I have one health drink remaining. Oh, fuck. All right, we survived. Somehow. Oh wait. It's downstairs, I'm so dumb. Oakley, holy shit, dude, how you been? How's life been, my guy? It has been a while. <laughs> uh, it was this one down here. There it is. Good and good. Glad to hear it. How am I doing? I'm doing good. Living it up. Living the dream, as some people would tell you. Alright, I need to reload my magnum. One shot in that, eight shots in that. Fuck. Yeah, man, just uh, just playing horror games. You know, same old, same old. Working during the day, screaming by night. <laughs> All right. Cool. That's done. Now what's in here? Hopefully a ton of fucking ammo. Oh, yeah, something's about to happen. Everyone must die. I think I'll start with the servants that installed the wardrobe over the hole. They know too much and may warn the others. My new friends in the dungeon offered to help me with the killings. Of course, I gladly accepted. Oh, God. My guy, that was not the answer. All right, let's do a quick save here. Whatever fucking room this is. This game was surprisingly hard, if I remember correctly. It was a little rough. A little rough. True detective, yes. <laughs> What's up, frantic? <laughs> oh, 
Oh yeah, this is final boss material right here if I've ever seen it. Oh, you gotta be, dude. I didn't fucking reel it all the way. Oh! Woo -hoo! Run, you klutz! Oh, that's not good. Why are you gonna be an asshole like that, dude? Oh my god, I've got like multi hit. You know what? I'm gonna take a mulligan on this one. Yep, that's okay. Lord's Lair. Okay. Yeah, there it is. Thanks, Meg. <laughs> Fucking unbelievable. <laughs> Wait, why? I thought this was supposed to be a six shooter. Oh. I guess not. Capacity is five. Okay. Thanks again, Meg. Where would I be without you? Oh, oh, shit. Okay. Well, that has six shots in it. Let's see if it can. Got the dyn. Oh, the dynamite could be helpful once he uh, once he starts making the skeletons. I can just throw one dynamite and I'll knock them all out. Meg carrying stream as usual. Less disappointment without me. That's true. My disappointment is. God immense. damn it. And my day is ruined. That thing is. Woo! Fuck. Oh boy. That's not good. Um, who has ammo? You have ammo. Oh, fuck me in the balls. Okay. Um. Uh, health drink. I got one left. One shot. Oh, okay, I get. Can I, like. I can't fucking reload from in here. That sucks. Um, I'm gonna need to use the shotgun, I guess. The old dick twist, hell yeah. That sucks. Have I'm you tried toast. not getting hit by everything? Just an idea. Thanks, thanks, Frantic. Appreciate you. And thanks for the old dick twist. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna throw another dynamite too. Oh, no, fuck off. Damn! Didn't explode in time. No problem, always here for a solution. Good. <sighs> Unbelievable. <laughs> F. Yeah, I really wish I had some more ammo. The problem too is the reload. When you reload, it slows you way down. But we'll keep trying. We'll get there eventually. I got another half an hour. We're right in his fucking face.
how much fucking health he has, dude. What the shit is that? So fucked. I have three shots up before I have to get a melee with Okay. So we're down to Uh-huh, yeah. A crowbar. This this run was way better though. I think I'm actually fucked. I think I legitimately am fucked in this game. I think I, I saved to points where I don't have- I should have been using my melee a lot earlier in the game. And I was just using the ammo up. So... <coughs> Fuck off. It's hardly taking health away from him. This is the dumbest game of fucking... Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be so bad. <laughs> you ever get the three heads? Three heads. Oh, no. No, I only have two. But, I mean, there's no other... I don't think there's any other people I can... Who have to, like, I think I have to kill him to get these... Oh, well, the square slots is done. Circle slots are done. Done all that in the dungeon. The basement. The barrel of acid, but I don't have an empty jar. Uh, there's the creature in hole. Really toilet... That's where we got the second head. Your book. First floor. Did that to make the acid. We did the coin shaped indent. Student gallery. There's the hexagon and square shaped. Yeah, I've done everything. Why does your character swing that crowbar slower than shit? I was doing a heavy swing so that it would um, inflict more damage. But. The problem is that he generates too many fucking enemies. <sighs> was just a thought. Yeah, no, I, it's, I was hoping I was hoping that I, I would find something on the map to be like, oh my god, I forgot. And then could go there and like find the other head. I'm gonna see if uh Nightmare of Decay. See if I could figure out where to find um, the shit. This is the, easily the most deadly foe you will encounter all of Nightmare of Decay. No shit. Uh, so I'll quickly to run the first skeleton. It results in a skeleton with a shield. Hmm. 
Knife melee only has a lot of ducking in and out of his range to attack. Using anything you will want to use the holy water you potentially collected for a quick kill. I had to fucking use it on the goddamn spider. <sighs> Fuck. Two to four direct hits with the holy water will destroy the Lord of the Nightmare. But only, there's only one holy water. Fuck. Otherwise, keep on the move to the side. Blast away with what ammo you have. You can deflect, he can possibly deflect some bullets. That's bullshit. What I want to find is... Mm-hmm. I'm trying to see if there's anything that'll help me find Oh, if there's another head somewhere. Uh, three heads. He gives me two holy waters, a health drink, and magnum ammo if I give him that shit. Same woman had to be found when the sewer hallway in her own chamber which requires the bolt cutters that got it. The middle-aged woman head can be found within the blood splattered bedroom. You need the blood wardrobe key. We got that. The young woman head can be found in the pantry in the kitchen. Oh my god! I didn't even see it in there. You need to collect the coin from her hand and possibly defeat the meat golem and take her head. Okay. Yes, I remember the meat golem. Holy shit. We have a potential here, everybody. I hit the wrong button. Yep, nope, don't wanna be there yet. This is good. Fat stuff's fucking figured out that what we need to do here. He's gonna give us two holy waters. That's gonna take out a ton of his health. Fucking massive. I was gonna say, where am I gonna find another head? <laughs> Perfect, though. Damn, good luck. I'll talk to you. I need sleep. Yeah, man, get some sleep for sure. Um, I'm sure I'll talk to you tomorrow. But I do hope uh, you have a, if you end up going to the show tomorrow night, you have a great fucking time. It had to be somewhere. <laughs> yeah, it, it had to be. So there had to be something that was going to be helpful. Sometimes you gotta look up these, you know, these walkthroughs just to kind of get like the concept down of okay. What if I missed, or what detail am I not thinking of? Okay. Okay. So I need to get to the pantry, which, oh. Impaled body, right here. Yeah, I think what it was is when I did this, it's before I talked to the creature. So I couldn't take the head. Now I could. Right, we can go right up the stairs. 
Oh, right. Yep. I have to go back this way. Round. Ooh. Mm. Ooh, shit. But yeah, these holy waters are definitely going to help. I think it's going to take out at least half of his health. And everything else I throw at him is going to be good, too. All right, my friend. Expression is eerily peaceful. A small favor completed. Excellent. You have brought me three beautiful female ads. Please wait a moment while I fetch you your reward. Who's even some head for some change? Hell yeah. <laughs> Thank you for that, stranger. Please enjoy your reward. Hey, you got it, bro. Two holy waters, magnum ammo, two health drinks. And that's it. Okay. Uh, so out of curiosity, what do I have left for achievements? I've only got three of them. Finish the campaign on any difficulty. Finish the campaign on hard difficulty. Successfully escape from the dungeon in dungeon escape mode. I guess there's another mode that unlocks. Finish the campaign on any difficulty in under one hour, bro. Finish the campaign on any difficulty without saving or loading. Finish randomizer mode on any difficulty. Survive past wave 10 in horde mode. Finish the campaign on any difficulty without using any healing items. Finish randomizer mode on hard difficulty. Finish the campaign on hard difficulty without saving or loading. Finish the campaign on any difficulty without sprinting. Finish campaign on difficulty using only melee weapons. And finish campaign on any difficulty using only the survival knife. Bro, these achievements are bullshit. <laughs> Absolute bullshit. Alright. Let's go fuck this dude up. <clears throat> the problem is, is that there's no quick way to get back down there, so we do have to do a little bit of traveling, but that's okay. We'll get there. <laughs> and then I'll make sure to save it before I go in, so that way everything I just did, we don't have to redo. Which is why I love saving the game so often. <laughs> and yeah, maybe that gets me in trouble sometimes. Oh well. It is what it is. But I thoroughly can see that I've done everything I could in this game, except for the final boss here, so... I feel so much better, because I'm like, do I get the head afterwards and just bring it back as a joke? And it gives me, like, new game plus weapon or some shit? If he was like, here, here's a fucking, like, MP5, I'd have been like, oh shit, okay. Then from here, I go this way. Cross the bridge. Now I'm in the hallway with all the ammo was. It's cool if the ammo fucking respawned by accident. I would have been so happy. What can you do? Okay. Just come through spraying next time. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Um, can I make oh it already is number six. Oh fuck yeah, baby. <laughs>
Fuck you, dude. Run! Run! Fucking idiot. Okay, well, I killed all your buddies. Let's take some health drinks. And, uh... Let's use this up, shall we? Fucking hell, dude! Oh, shit, I forgot about you. Got him! Let's go! Those holy waters were so important. Thank you, Fat Stuffs. You came through in the fucking clutch. Imagine if I had all fucking three. Oh my god. Oh, woke up out of my nightmare. Oh my god, I have no legs. <laughs> oh, what a terrible nightmare. You're covered in sweat and your heart is thundering in your chest as you get up from your bed. It's still the middle of the night and it will be some time before the sun rises. You don't feel like going back to sleep. Not after that horrific nightmare. Been there. All three would have been an insta-win. Yeah, pretty much. Maybe a short walk outside and some fresh air will help to calm you down. Sounds like a terrible idea. Let's play the game. Do, 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 do. Ah, good game. Um... If this this cat shouldn't talk though, I'm not in my dream anymore. Oh god, he's gonna talk. Oh no. I'm still dreaming. <clears throat> Hello again, stranger. Did you really think that you could escape from the nightmare? It's like I said in the beginning, no one ever escapes alive. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Oh, it's the creature. Fuck. You've awakened from the nightmare. But the real nightmare has just begun. This game was completely based off of a two sentence horror story. I love it. I just can't be on any difficulty. Woohoo! I think we're playing Nightmare of Decay. Total play time 2 hours and 40 minutes, 19 seconds. Extra game modes have been unlocked and can now be accessed from the extras menu. Let me go check that out. So, Dungeon Escape is escape from a procedurally generated dungeon. That's pretty cool. And then Horde Mode is Horde Mode, yeah. Disabled Cultists. That'd be nice. Oof. Well. That was a fucking game. Um, actually, we have a little bit of time. We definitely don't have time to play um, Last Lesson. So, let's check out these modes, huh? I didn't disable cultists. God damn it. I'll also give everything a shot here. Escape from the dungeon. Welcome to Dungeon Escape. You're trapped in an underground dungeon and must try to escape by reaching the surface. Assemble by leaving through the exit door on each floor. Equipment and supplies we purchased between floors of the credits earned by either killing enemies or looted from the dungeon. Clearing a floor of all enemies will grant an extra reward of 400 credits. Climb ladder to begin your escape. What do I fucking have? A uh, survival knife and a pistol? Fucking awesome. Great. Generating ma- oh fucking it's dark. No matter what door I... 
fucking take. I'm fucked. I like the map, though. That's cool. Fuck, 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 fuck. This is difficult. Oh. I have no health. Oh, fuck. All right, so that's not good. Roguelike mode, yeah. The zombies used to sound like someone got kicked in the sack. Sounds about right. And none of these have fucking things. Oh, they mean, well, I had credits in that one. If I don't find health soon, the dog's gonna kill me. 100%. Got to have all these credits, though. More credits, more pistol ammo. Oh, my God. Where are you all coming from? Waste of the bullet. Looks like something just launched out of it, but no. Nope. Fuck. Fuck. I think the dog is, uh, clearly not able to hear anything. Nice. I fucking knew it. You have to start over? That sucks. I've got to disable cultists again. Alright, well... I forgot, the crowbar is much better to use. Unfortunately, we only have a fucking... ...knife.
Damn it. I don't want credits. Thank you. Oh! Oh, it's the exit door right here. Do I trust it? Ooh. Oh. Oh. So now we're talking. All right, now I feel like I can go fight. I wasn't there a second ago. It's like I couldn't fucking see that shit before. All right, so there's only two doors we haven't unlocked yet. That one's empty. Hi. Oh, shit. Oh. Sorry, my dude. Give you quite the splitting headache there. <laughs> There's a lot of them. Oh, there we go. Ah, a little indentation there looks suspect. Oh, boy. And there's nothing back here. <laughs> it's just creature, the fucking zombies. Hey, we did that. Well, that one's on fire. I thought it was a fucking torch earlier. Well, he wasn't that bright after all. Okay. Oh. That's good. All right. Ooh, a piece of dynamite. Look at that. All right. Look at there's one more door we haven't touched yet. 
Oh, now I'm exhausted. Okay, now I'm good. Double door. Oh, back that ass up. Oops. Shit. Let's go. Let's go looting. Nothing? Wow. All right, I got credits at least, I guess. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. Floor one was fun. Can't wait for floor two. Oh my lord. Okay. <laughs> Holy shit. 300 question mark. Uh. How do I get that? Oh, that submachine gun looks like fun. Fuck, that was 200. Shit, I fucked that up. Whoops. Oh well. Fuck it. Good old Tommy gun. Yeah. Can I go back down? Nope. <laughs> Damn it. That'd have been fucking killer. I'd be like, I'm going back down and buying more. I may mean, only have 15, but. Oh, this room's already open. Oh, I thought there was someone right there around the corner. Oh, look how much pistol ammo is in here, too. Nothing. Okay. Let's make sure there's no other barrels in this area. See, there was nothing on the ground a second ago. going I forgot I had the Tommy gun next time I run into something scary I'm gonna pull that thing out and fucking lay into him put more pistol ammo and pistol ammo Got you, bitch. Oh, there's the exit. See you, bitch. Coins. I ain't leaving yet. Not with 65 credits. Not in this economy. Nice.
I knew there was one of you around the corner. Oh, fuck! I didn't think there was even another one of those around the corner, though. Jesus Christ. Alright, that was fun. Using the Tommy guns on that thing is fucking great. What do you even call these things? Reptilians, I guess? <laughs> That'll work. We've got more ammo for the submachine. The Tommy gun as well in here. I mean, I'd hope so. It's a big fucking room. Bro, really? There's another door this way. Got stamina back. Oops. Hit him one more time on the way down just in case, you know? The last shot was a shoulder shot. That was funny. Oh. Three of you? Okay. Glad I bought all that pistol ammo now, cause oh shit, twelve shots left, and there's still one asshole alive in here. Glad for all these credits, though. There's another door I haven't been through yet. Nothing, and there's a dog in the other room. I just heard it. Ooh, okay. All right. All right. Hell yeah, brother. Not too shabby. This mode's pretty cool. I do like this. Well, they ain't giving me dick for fucking lootables. Everyone runs faster with a knife. <laughs> and we out. Let's go. Team looks fun, yeah. Alright, first and foremost, I need a better melee weapon. That's the most important thing. Um... I'm okay with not existing with those guns yet. I gotta figure out what had. 
fucking funny as shit. I don't know how to get that other weapon. Um, get a couple of these. 250. Plenty. I'll keep 150 around so I'm halfway to his shotgun. Not that I, I'm going to be buying a shotgun, but you know. Ooh, right, I need to adjust this. So let's adjust. So the crowbar is number one. Missile's number two, so machine gun's number three. Um. I don't need to worry about the dynamite right now. All right, next level up. Nothing. All right, so there's only one door. Jesus. Well, okay. Small corridors. What the fuck is an executioner? Oh my fucking god, dude. Dude, this dude's taking no damage. Fuck, all right. Uh, so I think we're gonna die here for sure. Head. Yeah, fuck you. And you. Piece of shit. Fuck that. All right. Shit. I can't go towards the fucking dogs yet. Oh shit. At least they're only three shots. Oh, uh, why am I doing that? Oops. Is the exit. 
So she found that. I can always run into that and say fuck it if I need to. Oh fuck. I don't like doing that. You poor puppies. Fucking flew mid jump. It's a big fucking room. Oh, you motherfucker. Hello, my friend. Hope you're doing well. Standing by this door. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where, Where are you, are ghost? You? What the fuck? How old are you? Oh my <laughs> nice. Stop it. Stop it, Charles. All right, so I got to ask. I've I've watched a little bit of Lethal Company, very little. But what did you think after playing it? I already bought it. I'm going to play it next week. But I got to hear your thoughts on it. And everyone, come over from uh, from Diana's Raid. Thank you for dropping by. If you don't know me, I am the Juggernaut. You can call me Jug or Jugs. Uh, I am part of Channel 13 and CEOs of Screams, uh, as is Diana. So uh, we know each other pretty well, I'd say. It's a lot of fun. It's addicting also. It's great with friends. Fantastic. Good. And at 10 bucks, it's a pretty decent fucking price, too. Um, so, yeah, if you, uh, if any of you happen to dig my content over here and you're enjoying yourself, I completely welcome you to hit the follow button. Uh, we're four away from a thousand. It's like, it's so close. It's scary. It wasn't buggy at all and a lot of monsters. Sick. So there's a lot of content, even for an early release. It's almost the end of week already. Hell yeah. Yes, it is. It is uh, It is Thursday here. It's 2 in the morning where I am, Thursday. Um, where it's still early access to, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know if you've played this game before, but we're playing Nightmare of Decay. We actually we beat the story mode on normal, and it unlocked um, horde mode and dungeon, like dungeon mode. So I'm just doing dungeon mode for fun. Um, whenever I die, I'm probably going to raid out as well. To be honest, got so much content out of it. Hell yeah. Work tomorrow and Friday, then off for like a few days. So that's good. That's good. There's nothing there, right? No? Okay. So I gotta find if there's any other good uh, items to loot up in this room. Ooh. We got some pistol ammo that's good so basically you have to survive um each of the floors you have to find the exit when you find the exit it brings you to a store where you can use the credits in the bottom left hand corner to buy all sorts of different items guns ammo health all of the above i'll be going to bed though i hope you have an amazing rest of your night Sorry to ready to run no all good totally gets you you'll be up early tomorrow and you know you to do all the crazy things that you do in a day what the fuck is that another dog God damn it, I don't want to fight another dog. I like dogs. Yeah, anywho, get some sleep, Diana. Thank you so much. Appreciate you, appreciate you uh, dropping in the raid and everything. Um, and I'm glad that you're, di you're digging Lethal Company. Fuck, I think I have one drink left. I have two. Use them up, baby. Ooh. 
You have to loot and sell to win, basically, without dying. Yeah, and if you clear the whole floor, they give you another 400 credits, which is obviously a lot. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not a gazillion dollars worth or anything like that, but it's it's sometimes worth it. The problem is on this floor, this is the third floor, we had a boss to kill and it almost killed me. Yeah, it is pretty difficult. I, oh, fuck. Fuck. Hold on, no, wait, time out. Alright, time in. Wish I had my Tommy gun. Oh, I have two shots left, okay. Oh, you bitch. Oh, oh it's like, how is he still alive? <laughs> cool, that one's done. Oh, fuck. I could really use... I mean, pistol ammo is always important, but, uh... Some health would be nice. Alright. Back this way. There's another door over here to the left. Whoa. I keep shooting over its head. That's the problem. Little reload. Did I actually do the? I didn't do the full reload. I have to wait. Uh, okay, that makes sense though. Hey, bud. More pistol ammo. Let's go. Here? No? Alright, that's pretty much it in this room. Okay. And looks like we have one more room down here. How much should how many more rooms are off of this room? I don't know, but we'll find out. I don't know why that dude happens to randomly have fire in his head, but he does. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Shit. Definitely seem faster. Let's go! Floor cleared. Another 400 in my pocket. Go check out this room for any goodies. More pistol ammo. Pistol ammo. Oh look, pistol ammo. <laughs> Shit. Alright, cool. Well, now we can get it the fuck out of here. And here's the exit. So... Now we're at the store. Still don't know what the hell that's supposed to be and why we haven't- why it's not there. Maybe we have to defeat the game on hard mode to be able to get that. But this was my, uh, crowbar. And this was the Tommy gun. So we've got 805. Should really just buy the RPG. Uh, really can't though.
go. Not for those. 390. And I could buy the shotgun if I want to. No. Get one more of those, and then I think I'll hold on to the rest. Let's see. Oh, okay. Cool, cool. Everyone's all loaded up, ready to go. We are. All right, floor four, here we go. I'm still alive, so I'll still keep playing, I guess. And then once I... Oh, it's a whole different type of door now? That man came running. Holy shit. Oh, fuck. These fucking skeletons suck. You have to wait for them to... Oh, well, I guess floor four is where it starts to get a little bit more difficult. Lots of pistol ammo, please. You gave me fucking nothing. Sons of bitches. Found the exit. What is that? Little demon bastard. Look at him. He was easy. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> There's the oh, 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 hello. That's what I call some good ammo. All right, there's the exit. And now we can see if I can actually pull off the rest of the cleanliness of this. Oh. Yep, gonna get some more credits. Alright. Let's see. Oh shit. Alright, he's pissed. Oh, I'm on the way down. This one's missing an arm. That's interesting. Oh shit. Ow. Don't tell me the game just crashed on me. It did. Well, that's one way to die in the game, I suppose. <laughs> All right, well, just so you all know, I didn't die. The game died before I did. What can you do? <laughs> Jesus. All right, well, I want to thank you all for hanging out. I think we had a... Uh, uh, this game went a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Um, I thought we were going to have time to play the other game, but that's okay. We'll save it. We'll be, we'll be able to play it again. Let's see. Uh, tonight looks like it's going to be a raid over to Noxler, fellow Channel 13 buddy. He's actually, uh, he's playing some Cuphead. So he's probably getting real angry. <laughs> but yeah, let's, uh, Let's get this raid set up. Oh, is my raid button broken again? Of course it is. Love you too. Unbelievable. All right, well, I can just type it in myself. No biggie. 
Um, how much is the rest of your night, Chuck? No, you. And night to you too, Bootylicious as well. If you're all able to join me on this raid, I think it'd be cool if you could. Uh, if you look here, I just dropped into chat. You'll see our raid messages. The first one, which I'm pasting in again, uh, that is for subscribers of the channel. You can use those emotes or any other channel emotes, really. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, uh, you can use the other emotes, the, the, any other emotes you really have, or the generic ones I put up there, which just says raid on it. Uh, you can follow me on some other social platforms. You find me on YouTube. I'm going to be uploading VODs every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, and then starting next week, YouTube Shorts every Tuesday and Thursday. If you prefer YouTube Shorts, look and feel like it's on the TikTok app because you want to watch them on TikTok. I'm also there. Same, th same stuff. I'm also on Twitter or X, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I make announcements there, share memes, I'll post all sorts of ridiculous shit. Um, and then Discord, the home away from home of the Jug Mob. If we're not in this, if we're not in the stream hanging out, we're usually in there doing some community watch parties. Uh, we can be playing stuff like you know like Jackbox and whatnot. Um, we have some watch uh, watch parties, play some horror games, have a good time with that. Um, and then there's also the polls that I hold there and all the other sorts of different announcements. Announcements will go to Discord first before anywhere else, any other social media platform. So if you want to be in the know, get in the Discord. Um, but yeah, that is really all I got tonight. And I really got to go to the bathroom. My bladder's like, hey, got to empty. So... I'm gonna raid over to Knox and then I'm gonna go uh, take care of business, that's for sure. Anyways, thank you all for hanging out. Appreciate you for being here. Uh, again, apologies, it's only two days this week, especially where I was out all last week. Um, we we'll back to a, at least a three day week next week. I'll see if I can squeeze in four to kind of catch ourselves up. Um, but thank you all for being here and, and having a good time here. Thank you, Diana, for the raid earlier. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go fucking chill out and enjoy these these shows they have coming up. Wrestling on Saturday, by the way, join Discord if you want to watch AEW Full Gear. I'll we'll I'll be up there watching it and whatnot. So, but yeah, that's all I've got. I'm gonna go, uh, you know, do stuff. Bye.